So this is Verbicina alternifolia, Verbicina alternifolia, and we'll talk about that name here in a second, but this is a, a really cool plant in the Asteraceae family. So like all plants in the Asteraceae family, this flower is actually a flower head made up of a bunch of flowers, made up of, made up of a bunch of flowers. So each one of these petal-like, uh, petal-like appendages is actually a flower. And on, uh, on Verbicina, this is also called wing stem commonly. On Verbicina, uh, that, that petal, let's see if we can get a focus here, that petal-like is, is actually a flower, ray flower, and it's, for, it's sterile, it's sterile, sorry, sterile. And these are, these are disc flowers. The center, each one of these little is a flower, and they're disc flowers. So there's like six to eight ray flowers, petal-like ray flowers, and they usually kind of fall off. They're messy. It's not in a, as you can see here, let's zoom out, it's not the most beautiful. It's a cool plant, but I mean, they're not, they're not full and showy, which is fine. It doesn't need to be. And uh, each one of these, these disc flowers, is, is fertile. And the, the stamens are going to come up before the, before the, um, the uh, pistil does. And uh, that's just to try to help prevent, you know, selfing or anything of that nature. Uh, and so this could have 20 plus to maybe up to 60 or more uh, disc flowers. So a lot of disc flowers. And then they turn into these cool seeds, these cool winged, oftentimes winged seed heads. These oftentimes winged seed heads. And look what's hiding there. Look what's hiding there, this spider. I have no clue what it is. I'll maybe look it up and put it in the text. So the gold moth uh, also uses verbicina as its host plant. Um, and it's a beautiful moth, absolutely beautiful moth. And if I find it, I'll, I'll put it on the video here. Uh, they, they usually lay their, they uh, feed on the flowers of verbicina. So this is their host plant. So the name verbicina uh, is verbena-like, verbena. And the reason it's called, an alternifolia, because it's foliage, it's leaves, folia, is usually alternate. Sometimes it's kind of opposite, but usually, like, let's look here. See, it's, um, it's usually alternate, al alternately arranged. And ver verb, uh, verbicina, because the leaves are, um, are ver kind of like uh, the verbenas. And it's going to be very scabrous, very rough leaves, uh, coarsely toothed, coarsely toothed, very rough on both sides, coarsely toothed. And then it, it's winged. It's called wing stem. Okay, I had to shut the video off for a second so I can move this. It's called wing stem because the leaves uh, grow down onto the stem and, and form this wing-like structure, this wing-like structure. So Verbicina has these alternate leaves, alternifolia, that's its name, wings, alternate leaf. Uh, it has these alternate leaves, rarely opposite, but sometimes you see that scabrous, coarsely toothed, um, coarsely toothed, um, and then it has, again, these flower heads that are, that are, um, that have these these uh, really cool wing seeds, um, these ray flowers, six to eight petal-like ray flowers, and uh, yeah, let's go find a gold moth. So this is a great example of the alternate leaves, as you can see here, in the uh, the winged stem. So look at that winged stem here. We can see it, that winged stem. So taking a look at these verbicina seeds, they they have these flat akenes. Let's break this up and take a look here. They, and hopefully it doesn't blow away. They have these flat winged keens. You can see they're winged. They have, there's a spider. Oh boy, I just killed a spider. So there, here is, let's see if we can get it. See, that that is one akeen there. Most of them have fallen off. We're in the spring now. Uh, but you can see this flattened, more round akeen here. Let's pull it off and hope we don't get a bunch of insects. Um, and it has these two appendages that kind of come out of the top. Uh, it's often, see those, so it's winged, see those nice wings? So it not only has a winged stem, but it has a winged akeen, which is pretty cool. Um, yeah, so it doesn't have like some of the things in our asterace. It doesn't have that that uh, hair-like pappus like you'd see in like a dandelion or something. So yeah, there's, there's its fruit, the Verbicina alternifolia.